Hey everybody, Steven here, and for today's video in Subnautica, I'm going to show you what is on the other side of the Aurora there. So, that's the ship. Now once I'm here, I'm actually going to just start heading to the back end of it here where these jets are. And, uh, hopefully this will save anybody time if you're going, because as you'll see, there's really not much of anything on the back end over here except for a bunch of Reaper Leviathans. Now I'm in creative mode, so they're not gonna really do anything to me, but uh, if you're not in creative mode, uh, they'll mess your Seamoth up, or if you have uh, a Cyclops or a Prawn or anything like that, they'll mess it up pretty bad. So um, I do have the sonar here, so I'll, I'll be able to show you guys kind of what I'm looking at. As you get closer to the ship too, it'll actually start to vibrate, and you'll hear the vibration. Um, and we might actually get to see this thing blow up. Not sure or not. There's one right there. Um, that accompanied by that noise gets pretty creepy. Uh, we have the jets, but there's not really anything like... S uh, you might find some parts, and I think there's... Part... Like that noise. In this region are sparse. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. Um, <laughs> that was super creepy. Uh, it's just black over here, so one, it's hard to see. There we go. Oh, he got me. <laughs> oh, I didn't think they'd do that in creative mode. He's not gonna do anything, though, because it's, uh, creative mode. Oh, man. Oh, that's super creepy. So you got one there, one there. Oh, that always creeps me out. That for real scared me. <laughs> um, got another one right there. And especially when it's pitch black like this, which it might be getting closer to night now, which is why it's like this. Um, but there's a couple deposits hopefully it won't get me there's another one over there yep way over there so it's just covered with uh, reaper leviathans um You'll actually eventually get to the edge over here, and then it's just a straight drop-off, so it's not going to go anywhere. Uh, there's another one right there. Let's hope he doesn't see me. This is, by the way, is one of the scariest games in terms of that type of stuff that I've played. Like, far scarier than other games. Um, Silent Hill, stuff like that. And I know there's other ones that are out there that are way scarier. I just don't play a ton of scary games. Um, <laughs> because this one right here is scary enough for me. Uh, we get to the edge, and you could go down there forever. That d doesn't go anywhere. Alright. And now we're actually technically on the side of the ship here. I'll go closer again. Hopefully they don't run into... Because there's a couple of them over here now, too. So you'll find debris. Um, you'll find some mineral deposits somewhere in certain places. Uh, stuff like this, but that's about it. Probably should have turned my lights on a long time ago, by the way. Just now noticed that. Um, there's another one. So, uh, I think we have some large deposits of stuff in a couple spots. I was hoping that there would be something special. Maybe somebody knows something that I don't know. But, honestly, I haven't found... 
anything. I thought maybe like a blueprint would be over here or something. And uh, it is barren. And now, I mean, this is just the outside hull of the Aurora here. And we're coming to the front end. And... That's why, too, it's nighttime. Um, I mean, and that's it. That was it. I get to the front end over here. Now we kind of, as we wrap back around, we come more and more towards... Uh, different zones, but you got another Reaper Leviathan there. But that is about it, guys. Ah! So, hopefully that saves anybody the uh, trouble of going to this other side. Just like I said, there's not really anything over there unless you just want to run into a bunch of Reaper Leviathans and get <laughs> scared like I just did. Um, so that is it. If you guys like the video, hit the like button for me. If you want to continue to follow along with my playthrough of Subnautica and all the other games that I play, hit the subscribe button for me. And thank you so much for watching.